Egypt has been leading the region in futsal. It's ranked top of all Arab and African states. It has qualified to the World Cup five times since 1996. This year they beat Cuba 7-1 in the opening game, but lost heavily from Russia and Thailand. Some experts say these results are good, considering the poor preparations for the tournament. It's a medium performance, but they're not to blame. The Football Association hasn't given them much time to prepare. The players are not well prepared physically or psychologically for the World Cup. They gathered the team and began preparations only a month before the cup. Meet Aqba Club is providing four players out of the 12 representing Egypt in the World Cup. It's a young generation with an average age of 23. Yet the Pharaohs take on a strong Italian team in the second round. And they hope to emulate the success of 2006 when they were sixth on the world. The futsal team's qualification to the second round of the World Cup is something Egypt's first team has never managed to achieve. Yet so many Egyptians are not aware of these remarkable results. The matches are not broadcast on the main TV channels. There's not much media focus. Even social media doesn't cover a lot. Before the Olympics, we noticed the banners and billboards in the streets showing the handball and football players. But there's nothing for the futsal team. There's no advertisement at all for people to know about the futsal team. Maybe if the pharaohs go further in the tournament, the media would have to stand up and take note. Yas Hakim for CCTV, Cairo.